Now we are doing exercise 10.2 question number 4. Question number 4, let me write down the question. Question says if 10 of a is equal to 3 divided by 4, find cos a, find cos a and cosec a and cosec a. Solution. So if 10 a is equal to 3 by 4, if 10 a is equal to 3 by 4, find cos a and cosec a. So here, what do we know? What are the formulas that we are going to use here? Formulas will be formulas that we are going to use is first formula that we are going to use is sec square a minus 10 square a is equal to 1. This is the first formula. After that, we know the value of sec. So 1 by sec a is equal to cos a. This is the formula which we are going to use. And the third formula will be cos square x cos square a plus sine square a is equal to 1. And at last we are going to use the formula 1 by sine a is equal to 1. Okay. So we can use okay, well, this is equal to cosec a. Okay. These are the four formulas that we are going to use in this question. I hope you know you know all this formula from before. So let me write down properly. Okay, now first first formula. So now now given. Okay, first let me write down given. What is given? Given is where is my eraser? So given ten a is equal to three by four. So using sec square a minus 10 square a is equal to 1 we can write down sec square a minus 10 square a 10 is 3 by 4 so 3 by 4 whole square is equal to 1 now next sec square a so sec square a minus 3 square 3 3 9 4 square 4 4 16 is equal to 1 sec a square is there so transfer this side it will become 1 minus will become plus divided by 16 so sec a sec square a is equal to 16 will come here so 16 plus 9 divided by 16 16 plus 9 it is 25 divided by 16 and if you find out sec a sec of a will be equal to root over 25 by 16 which will be equal to 25 it is root over 25 it is 5 and 16 it is 4 so it is 5 by 4 we got value of sec a to be 5 by 4 but the question is asking us cos a and cosec a okay so so next we know that cos of a is equal to 1 by sec of a right so cos of a is equal to 1 by sec of a sec of a is 5 by 4 right we are using first formula we have used and now we are using second 1 by sec a is equal to cos of a so sec a is 5 by 4 so sec a is 5 by 4 so cos of a is equal to 1 divided by sec a that is 5 by 4 4 will go up and it will become 4 by 5 okay so cos a is 4 by 5 next after this let us okay now cosec cosec of a what will be the cosec of a so we have the formula this one let us use this formula now using now using sin square a plus cos square a is equal to 1 sin square what is sin square a sin square a is we don't have any sin square a here only we have cos square cos right so i can write down this one as sin square a 
plus cos a that is cos square a cos square a will be 4 by 5 cos a is cos 4 by 5 square is equal to 1 sine square a is equal to 1 minus 4 by 5 4 by 5 whole square which i can add down 1 minus 4 for the 16 divided by 5 5 for the 25 right so 4 square and 5 square okay 25 will come here and 25 minus 16 by 25 25 minus 16 it is 9 divided by 25 and sine of a will be root over 9 by 25 so root over 9 it is 3 25 it is 5 so sine a is 3 by 5 still we do not get the answer the answer is the question is asking us to find cosec x so finally let me take let me write down here okay let me write down here so now we know cosec x is equal to 1 by sine a and sine a is 3 by 5 so 1 divided by 3 by 5 3 by 5 5 will go up it will be 5 divided by 3 okay so therefore cosec a is equal to 5 divided by 3 and this is our answer okay this is our answer one and another is cos i think yeah so we got our answer to be cos a is equal to 4 by 5 and cosec a is 5 by 3 i hope the answer is correct that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video